I think we're crazy, chat. Can I jump that? Hold on. I don't think... Can I just climb it? Can I run up the wall? No, definitely not. Okay, definitely not. Alright, well, you know, it was worth a shot, so... There's that. There is that. Yeah, there's like a... Weird thing over here. I don't know what that is, but... Gonna exit. Yeah, on the one HP survival. The one HP survival, that's right. Got a trait point. Willing to bet that there's going to be a checkpoint up through here at some point. I'm going to try to just hustle through here. That's fucking rip, man. Unfortunate. I guess it gives you... I guess it just gives you a checkpoint right here at the entrance. That's cool. I figured there would just be a checkpoint on the other side of this, but, I mean, that's cool, too. the dream work in my opinion. Yep. 15% increased revive speed? Hell yeah. Take it. I'll take it, chat. Wait, more bad news. a little bit more that'd be good that'd be very good oh 
All right, let's do this. down the path here. That's the same. Yeah, it's the same path. I didn't fully explore up top, but I can always come back. So I'm going to carry on. Might be okay. Wait. So this is this is not the main quest area. Though, so might end up being good to just go ahead and clear this. But I need to see. I need to see what we're looking at first. Faster. There is something over here. I don't think it's just the main, or I don't think it's, I don't think it's main quest related. I think it's like an NPC or something. All right, there is, okay, so that's where the main objective goes. Seems like there's these like checkpoint areas. Do want to check that out, but let me. What is this? Oh, there's there's something to this. Hmm, this looks important. There's got to be a clue somewhere as to what that does. Also, that looks like that's something we can explore. So, oh, also, um, how the fuck did I miss this stuff? Oh, here we go. Uh, oh, okay. Okay. Um, Well, this is a picture of the things here, but it doesn't really give me an indication as to, like, pegs and stuff. I'll have to look at that later. Before we do all that, let's glide down here real quick and see what this is. This map just got a whole lot bigger. Holy shit. Not gonna lie, I was not... I was not really expecting... All of this to be under here. Ha! 
Oh, this is way faster than charging. Maybe. Oh yeah, that's way faster. Oh, rip. I probably should have just shot stuff. I was being greedy. I was greedy, chat. It's on me. wonder if I can make that. No, there's no way I'm making that jump. I found it at first like they were like spawning behind me. Blood Jewel. Take a look. Charge melee attacks applied bleeding. Okay. I'm not doing melee, so. Okay, so we got everything under there. I'm assuming that this red area up top here, I don't know where that extends from, but it looks like I need to go the, I, I need to figure out a way up and around that way. And it probably has something to do with the stuff earlier. This, uh, I kind of want to go check this out. I'm not going to lie. I don't want to go check that out. Like you can see, you can see that trail over there, but it's not connected. It's not connected to this part. It's gonna be connected to that other part either, but I mean, maybe it's worth a look around. Come get maybe there's somehow a way to connect it over on this side. I don't know. I don't think so. That was rough. <laughs> There's got to be a different path. We'll figure that out later. I'm not too worried about it. How's the game? It's pretty good so far. I like it a lot better than from the ashes. I like it a lot better. I 
lot more polish for sure. I basically just wanted to see what was beneath the ladders over here. And it's funny enough, it's probably not much, but who knows? There's like a whole, there's like a whole region over here. So I definitely don't want to sell myself short here. This area is a little bigger than I thought it would be, if I'm being honest. A little bigger than I thought it would be. Let's check this area first. I feel like it would make sense if there was a chest or something up there. Holy hell. Wouldn't be surprising. Uh possibly up here. Uh there actually is a chest in there. I can see the icon. Nothing over here. Let's go get that chest over here. I don't know how I missed that. I think I was in combat. Maybe I just ran past it. Wasn't paying attention to the mini map. Yes. Good. And. Okay, so this actually does kind of sort of connect back with this path that I was on earlier. That, that's good. That means that. Means that it's like actually kind of worth doing this, so I'm not just like going way out of my way, like you know, knowing that the paths ultimately converge. Would totally be a place for a boss to show up. Paxultek, it is here. Paxultek. Friend Paxultek, it returned. I've been here before. <laughs> but of course it has. Long ago the Paxultek and I spoke of songs and... Ah, of course. It is not the same Paxultek. Forgive me. The horns, it does not have them. <laughs> yeah. I lost a friend. I have traveled these woods for countless days. I fear to send Paxultek to the temple. Alas, the great water heart which tales tell once open. Yet beware, friend Paxultek, for the Ravager has been killed. May it find favor. Uh, I have a trait point. I'm gonna go all in on Vigor for now. Okay, so that's where that lever was, which now makes a lot of sense. 
So we got to figure out this puzzle. It looks like this pulley system thing here. earlier oh that looks important okay it's probably not a bad idea to check that file that there's like a files section somewhere um maybe not that's weird. the files in here i just gotta figure out what this stuff means read the file and see if there's anything worthwhile in here. Instruction stands down this midpoint. I think we once thought it an honor. If Quagmire's the way to the honor, then I wish I'd remained only the second. I fear my cohorts will drive me mad. Uh, it doesn't look like there's anything. Ravager, the workers call it, has feast of soldiers. Auto construction was completed. We were stuck in sockets of endless tuning. Yes, there's a drawing of the Ravager. Nothing in the stories can prepare you for it. Would you fell upon our guard? I'm ashamed to say I did not linger to ascertain their fate. Beast fell dead asleep. After he pulled the lever, thought this would be an opportunity to open the beast's throat. Monster bit it. I mean, I guess technically, do I really need to do this puzzle right now? Like, it very much looks like that's the side objective, and this is the main objective. So, I guess we could come back. Because I'm way too tired to try to figure out. I'm way too tired to try to figure out this puzzle right now. I think we should just go this way. That, that checkpoint should allow me to fast travel back there, so I'm not too worried about it. I'm also not going to be live too much longer anyway, so... I'll probably go for like another half an hour, 45 minutes. I don't know what happens. Rest, get a little resupply. Get a weapon mod. Oh, do I, oh, I got something for a weapon. Nice. Must have gotten it when I killed that boss. I should get a weapon mod on the, uh, the pistol. That'd be a good idea. Here we go.
game goes nuts whenever I pause, or like whenever I go into the menu. Alright, so that is on the other side of this. Which, of course, we're going to need to find half to. fun okay that's so fun i love that how's the game so far it's pretty good pretty good dog here they come I think that's probably the way to the quest. So I'm gonna double back this way for now. That is unfortunate. But it's okay. It's okay. If the presser on this actually like makes it to where enemies don't aggro from like a distance.
Oh my god. Uh, Alright, I gotta slow down. I wanna just like run through because there's like I have the items here, but these guys are just too fast. I can't outrun them. Oh. At least that's over. yet but much better Wildlife didn't take too kindly. Didn't take too kindly to me. Uh... Ooh, best friend. Let me see what this perk does. Fully restores the companion's health. That's sick. bit more survivability out of my dog. The doze, right? boy there's my good boy here's here's a side dungeon 
Seems like there's quite a few more side dungeons in this than there was in the OG. Seems like that's a bit more uh, prominent, so to speak. Now there is still some stuff over here. Let's go check out the uncharted area here and then we'll go We'll go into that dungeon. Uh that's up top. I gotta go around. Yeah, we'll check out that dungeon here in a minute. Okay. This is I don't, it. I don't really think there's much of anything over here, but Figured I may as well check it out all the same. Yeah. Oh wait, no, there there is more here actually. This isn't the best situation, but let's grab this. Jesus. I'm gonna try to recover a bit from this. Glad that's over. Okay. Anything to cure root rot, just out of curiosity. Okay, it's it's this right here. Good. Good, good, uh, good. This isn't looking good.
Okay, this is it. All right, what? So this just connects the other passage, then. Yeah. Okay. So we're just gonna keep going this way. Just gonna keep going this way. See what we got. Let's go down, and then I'm seeing those little dingray-looking things flying around. So, Here they come. try to keep a close eye. Let's grab the stuff over here. Just do a quick jog over here just to make sure. Got some ammo. Sometimes, like underneath, you know, like areas like this, sometimes they like to sneak in some iron and stuff. And I actually do kind of still need iron because I need to upgrade armor and I need to upgrade my pistol still. So, even though I've got my rifle to the point where it's using forged iron for upgrades now, I still have a use for the regular iron. I want to just completely. All right, so here's the path forward for the quest. But I think what I want to do, I want to see, I want to see what my options are like checkpoint wise. Cause I'm pretty sure the boss is probably close by. I, actually, I don't know. Maybe not. Well, that looks like the boss room, so it does appear to be something resembling the boss room. But I don't know if I'm gonna have to kill anything to get there. Or if it's just gonna be Pretty much a straight shot. Get down there. We are gonna find out. Okay, definitely not a straight shot. So, I don't actually have like any charges of my heal or anything, so I'm not gonna try to risk it. Or anything like that that said we should be able to get in and out of this area because the boss is here and i'm willing to bet that i can probably teleport Oh, I see. Okay. Um, okay, well, I'll stay here, but I think I'm going to head back to town and see if I can't knock out a couple of upgrades 
and then hopefully it won't take too long to kill this boss and then I think after we kill this boss I might call it for the day so let's go back to ward 13 see if I can't upgrade my pistol maybe even some armor I'd prefer to not get one shot by stuff so I also can get a weapon mod for my pistol too this better be good all right Oh. Cordyceps gland. Okay, so the root ganglia is not an option, but the cordyceps gland is an option. Rummer cracks the ground, spawns shock waves. Attaches to the enemy, dealing 40 damage. Here. All right, let's see what we can do about upgrading some gear. Uh, I don't have enough forged iron yet, but I actually have quite a bit of regular iron. So let's go ahead and go ahead and upgrade that, and then so long. There should be an armor upgrade person somewhere. But actually, another thing, I think these start at... No, I don't mean it started plus five. So, um, so, let me see. I actually don't remember who upgrades what the need? armor. What you look... Yeah. I'll watch your back. Armor upgrades. You just sell it, right? You don't upgrade. Yeah, you don't. You don't do the upgrades. <laughs> if you got. Keep your wits about you. Actually, this hey, guy had some pretty decent rings uh, for sale. I'm gonna buy that Firestone ring since the other ring that I have equipped is really not that good. Reduces incoming damage, increases all damage. Hardened Coil seems decent, but the problem is on this difficulty, that doesn't really matter. I think we're gonna do Heart of the Wolf. The best option. Mental. Melee stuff. Range crit damage. Range damage. Healing effectiveness, uh, gray health, elemental, melee, stamina. Uh, that, that's actually probably be good right there. better thing there maybe you don't upgrade armor in this game look maybe they took that out 
Because I'm not seeing an armor upgrade vendor. I mean, hey, it's cool with me if oh, that's okay. the case, but... Only... So there's mutators that I can actually make here. later. What's my best weapon mod option? I, I did make a couple of them. Catches. Shock waves. Uh, yeah, soul binder is probably the best one. Okay, so wait. Slow dodge. Makes sense. I do prefer the light dodge, honestly. It does make me a bit squishy, but I think the reality is like you're gonna be squishy anyway, so. All right, let's see what we can get away with here. You know what I find funny? You know, there's, uh, like, there's this... The fog gate is, like, right here, you know? And I figured... Figured that there'd be a cheese way to, like, drop down, you know? I figured there'd be a way to cheese it, you know? Instead of like death planes or whatever. I mean, considering that it is like a Souls like game, you know? If this was a Souls game, you bet your Batuti people would figure out how to do that stuff. They'd figure out how to like maneuver around the death planes and stuff. Where you could just drop down. Somebody will figure it out. Let's get through here. I'm gonna try to just run through to the boss. I believe this is just the bottomless pit of despair, so. Grab what I can.
Feels good having a lot of stamina. There is a purple dot that shows on the screen when you're near an item like that. That's good to know. It's actually like one of my concerns of like running through these areas is like I'm not going to see the important stuff. So it's good to know. Good to know that there's uh, options. Not options so much as it's just, you know, it's good to know that the map will do a uh, good job of showing things. At least, at least like blue and purple quality things. Can't help but feel like there's a gimmick to this boss. Need to figure out what it is.
Oh. Alright, so you gotta wait until the thing opens up. I've already, like, upgraded my stuff, but I just feel like my damage is, like, really weak. Doing really great damage here. But maybe I can... Maybe I can crowd control better. Here they come. Like, try to just like constantly go out there and accrue madness. I think you need to do a better job timing.
spot to be in right now. I may want to consider using a potion for this. Consider that I have I have money. It's not like I could probably buy one. I think they're like 500 maybe. Let me go back to town and see. And it persists through death. I just need a way to I need a way to stay alive, and I feel like I'm running out of stuff like really fast. So let me just see what my options are. I'm getting a little tired too, so wanna let's see. I think it's. It's the stew guy. It's this guy. Howdy! I can... What does he have? Okay, so... Max health. Max stamina. Stamina recovery. Health and stamina. And move speed. Move speed. Armor. Encumbrance. Root water. Take care, youngin. Don't be a stranger. Anything you need? Um, well, I would need some scrap. Try and upgrade. My rifle any further i do have the forged iron though if i can get like 100 scrap we'd be in good shape let me go talk to my lady friend here and see what i can Don't do suppose. keep trying um I think I'll sell. Stop by any time. You know where to find me. I think it was like 300. You can at least get one more rifle upgrade. In worst case scenario, I guess I can go do another dungeon, but I, I'm not going to do that today. All right, yeah, let's upgrade the rifle. You know That's good. Me. And then, you know, we'll... We'll try using this consumable and see if that helps.
What? Oh, that's... Got fucking smacked. It's insta-death. There's definitely windows of opportunity for me to do good damage here, but... That burn damage, getting some value. Can do something with this. Very nice. Take a look and see. 
Do we have... This looks like an area I've already been. Okay, so we're in like the upper reaches of this here. Which means that there's going to be a shortcut right here. Yeah. I was going to say there should be something around here because we definitely had that one door. Which this probably takes me right back to the one... spot earlier uh okay this is a slightly different spot than i thought it was but i know where we are I know exactly where we are and for that same reason oh there's an npc here whoa well hello there hold on uh trade point real quick Confused kind. I see. You gaze upon verdant Mirdra, spirit of the wood, nymph of the dappled glen. I don't care. I seek the knowing beast, the truth of nature held within your ark. You want to answer, so I will ask. Answer these questions true, sweet beast, so that your ark may be known and your eye may open. And do choose wisely. Yeah, I don't think she's got the only fans, dude. Sorry to disappoint. Heart. All right, we are gonna you try this and out. Four of your kin cross a mountain range to return to your homeland. Unknowingly, you set camp. Oh, we're gonna have to pick our own adventure book here. Burial ground. What do you do? In recompense, the clan requires you to leave your eldest with them for two years. Why would they do that? No harm will come to them. But you may have no contact during that time. If you agree, you and the rest of your kin may leave freely. If you refuse, your family must face a trial by combat. Do you leave your eldest to the unknown? Or risk death in battle? Fight back. I see. You are part of a group of druids who have been taken hostage by a Better believe we're fighting back. One of the warlord soldiers succumbs to your charms and says he will help you escape. However, the others must be left behind to die, though all have done nothing. Do you abandon your fellow hostages, or do you face death together? Um, I'm gonna mitigate death, so if they're doing nothing and they're just waiting to die, they can fucking die. <laughs> the ruler of your people but a small group of rebels has taken arms against you you could seek out a mutual solution but doing so prolongs the conflict and may bear no fruit at all or you could wipe them out and end the conflict immediately do you treat with the rebels or do you preserve the peace um I don't think we're preserving the peace by murdering a bunch of rebels, but uh, I would hear him out. I'm a feedback kind of guy. A handsome and powerful god visits Yesha with the promise to eradicate conflict, disease, and all suffering. Yeah, it's a fucking trap. In return, he demands a sacrifice. The life of a single young Pan. Do you give him what he asks? Nah, he's a fucking liar. I see. Your village suffers from a terrible goo. He's a fucking liar. He beats those weaker than he until they can no longer stand. All who have tried to reason with him have ended up the same way. Do you aid the victims or attempt to destroy the goon? You cannot do both. We're going to fucking wreck that Ooh, guy. How revealing. You have chosen your path, sweet beast. Your will is strong. The fire of the Ravager's eye glows within you. That's great. 
Is there anything else you wish to know? Of me? Or our wonderful world, perhaps? Who the fuck are you? You stand before Mirdra, spirit of the natural world, daughter of stem and stream. My sisters and I are the glorious weavers of all wild beauty. When mountain, spring, and sturdy tree trunk take your breath, sweet beast, that is us. That is our blessing. You have sisters. An immeasurable number. Mother stem and mother stream rely on us to sprawl and grow. Though we don't often commune with beasties such as you. Well, that doesn't not sound very nice age. when you put it that way. Especially not since what happened to Keula. A tragedy beast. Tragedy most cruel. Keula was fascinated by mortals, by your lives and stories. Unlike most of us, she made herself no secret. And you worshipped her with your short lives. Even built her a house. A temple, you called it. The root found her there. Oh, darn. We godlings are not easily unwoven, however. And it slew her not. But perhaps it would be better if it had. For what remains is no longer the sister I knew. But Sag. we hold happy thoughts. Regret only raises one life with another. Is there something else we can talk? Farewell, yeah. sweet. I don't have anything else to say to you, lady. Alright. Well, you know what? Hell yeah. I think this is a good stopping point. We'll continue this tomorrow, possibly. We still have some RE4 to do and, well, tournament prep and whatnot. And uh, I still want to play on Holy, so we, we got to find time for a lot of things this week. But, I mean, I'll definitely be playing a lot of Remnant over the next couple of weeks, probably. So we'll get through it. And honestly, I've been, I've been enjoying it so far. I, I will say I enjoy this a lot better than From the Ashes. I think that... This game has a lot more polish, so hopefully I won't feel too, uh, too, uh, like miserable trudging through it like I did with the last one. So, um, but yo, thank you guys all so much for tuning in. I'm going to get some sleep. I got to kind of get my schedule to where I can like be up for the tournament next week. So, uh, I got to start slowly shifting things around, but I do appreciate y'all hanging out. Follow me on social media if you guys enjoyed the stream. Follow me here on Twitch as well. Uh, also, don't forget our HelloFresh situation. I'm going to be doing a marathon, speedrun marathon in August. And the more signups we get for HelloFresh, the more games are going to be in the marathon. We still have a couple of weeks of uh, driving HelloFresh signup. So make sure if you guys haven't had a chance to check out HelloFresh and order your first box, you can use that code in the chat to get 50% off and free shipping. So uh, if you're looking to just save a little money, a little time on your grocery shopping and uh, also make some good food along the way, even if you're not an experienced cook, all these recipes are super easy to follow. And even if you have little to no experience, they are very, very easy to make. So um, thank you all again. Take care of yourselves and I will see you all tomorrow. Peace out, everybody.